What's up everyone? Welcome to Hartford, Connecticut. This is state number 45 for me. I'm um, going to explore a little bit of Connecticut and Rhode Island the next couple days, so come along with me and, and enjoy this ride. Uh, right now I'm standing in Bushnell Park, which is, is a large park here in Hartford. Um, behind me is uh, the state capital of Connecticut. Uh, which is closed today because it's Memorial Day when I'm filming this, um, so I'll have to check it out tomorrow. Um, but yeah, it's it's warm, it's humid right now, uh, but it's a beautiful day, and so I'm gonna walk around the city a little bit and uh, see what we can see. So enjoy. All right, I'm walking around downtown Hartford right now. Um, some cool buildings uh, here to see, and like directly behind me, which it's kind of hard to see with the trees, is the old Connecticut State House, uh, which I will explore tomorrow as well. But right now, I'm just enjoying the nice day and uh, gonna walk down to the riverfront here. So uh, let's keep exploring. down to the river front here and see what we can see. Okay, I'm standing outside the Connecticut uh, Science Center and they have this really cool uh, sundial out here and you can actually determine the time based on where you stand and uh, where, the, where your shadow is positioned. So um, this is, I'm in May right now as I'm filming this. So I'm gonna stand on the May uh, section here and it has my shadow at just after one o'clock, uh, which is the case. It's about 106, 107 as I'm filming this right now. So um, that's super cool. I like that. I like these sorts of things. Um, looks like it's a really cool uh, science center, but uh, I'm not going to go into it on this trip, but maybe it might be worth uh, checking out, especially if they have more of these things. So um, there you go. What's up, everyone? Kyle here. Um, I just went through the Mark Twain House and Museum um, right up above me, kind of hard to see in the shade, but um, super cool uh, house. It's got a lot of nooks and crannies and, and weird things to it, but um, it's a really cool house and uh, interesting man to say the least. And uh, yeah, definitely recommend checking it out here in, in Hartford if you're here. What's up everyone? I am here in Old Mystic Village in Mystic, Connecticut. And uh, this is a little uh, little area where there's a bunch of old shops and 
uh, like boutique stores and stuff like that. So um, definitely a tourist trap kind of place, but um, it's fun. So we're going to go explore. Alright, so I just had uh, a couple slices of pizza, slices of heaven, <laughs> um, at Mystic Pizza here in Mystic, Connecticut, um, based on uh, is the inspiration for the movie back in the 80s, I believe. Um, I watched it on the, on the flight over here. Um, but yeah, kind of cool to say I was there. So I'm walking here in downtown Mystic, um, cool little downtown, lots of cool little shops, some ice cream, yeah, Mystic Pizza up the street from the movie, and uh, the drawbridge um, is not too far away, so everything's really close and a good, uh, good place to spend an afternoon. What's up everyone? I am here in New Haven, Connecticut, and I'm walking around the campus of Yale University, established in 1701, which is insane to think about. Um, that's before America. Um, anyways, really beautiful campus, old buildings. Uh, there, yeah, I'm walking down this beautiful street here. And also the, and also the rain is coming down here so my camera's being funky because it's all wet and i getting soaked walking here so uh, i'm gonna make this tour short here but anyways um beautiful i feel smarter just being here um we got a beautiful library on campus which i will have pictures of and maybe a video um but this is my last stop in new haven and headed back uh, to hartford to drop off my car and catch the train back to New York. So I'll talk to y'all later. Well, here's another edition of things that don't go always go as planned when you're traveling. Um, part way, part way through my walk uh, around Yale right now, it decided to start downpouring. Um, and I don't have an umbrella, so I am now soaked uh, from head to toe. And uh, yeah, definitely gonna take a while to try out here. So I'm gonna get back in the car and I'm gonna drive to my next location and uh, hopefully get dry here sometime soon. But I am freaking soaked here, so um, enjoy that.